what's going on guys welcome back to the channel it's me John owner of boosted beamers of Chicago here we are New Year's Eve what are we doing today well we finally get some me time so project 335 we're finally gonna get to uh, replacing these uh, brakes that are in definite need of some help so we got the opportunity today um, we finished up most of the jobs here in the shop so I got the car up on stands right now we're gonna take a look at how bad these brakes really are they weren't horrible uh, the car sat for a while when when I bought it so most of the like surface rust kind of just you know went away and uh, the bite was was not bad at all but there may have been like one or two frozen calipers and you hit the brakes and like the car pulls to the left or something so um, here's what we're working with for today we've got front rotors Akibono premium brand same thing with the rear we've got Akibono we've got some remanufactured BMW front calipers we got reman BMW rear calipers we got our Akinobo front and rear brake pads and then we are using this ATE.4 brake fluid so that we can do our flush and then of course we've got our front and rear brake sensors and then we've got our hardware here for our calipers so I have to give a huge shout out to Advanced Auto we couldn't make this video possible without them uh, I reached out to them a little while ago, um, told them about the project that we were doing with uh, the 335 and they were thrilled. They were excited to be on board and they provided everything to get this uh, brake system completely overhauled front and rear. So huge shout out to Advanced Auto. I use them here at the shop. Um, I get my liquid molly from them. All these European brands that they carry for BMW literally on-time deliveries when I order it's literally here less than an hour maybe 45 minutes it's here at the shop uh, and that's most of the most of the items uh, that we get from them so once again thanks Advanced Auto you guys came through clutch on this one so uh, let's take a look at what the brakes are looking like now I've got the car up on jack stands and She's looking pretty crusty. I mean, uh, there's a little bit of a lip on the rotors, but you can tell, you know, there's some grooves in here. It's pretty rusty, just like the rest of the suspension. Uh, brakes, like I mentioned earlier, uh, may be frozen. Uh, she pulls to one side when we're hard on the brakes. Uh, the fluid reservoir looks pretty grimy as well. Fluid is almost black. Here's our rear. Again, a northern car full of rust. This rear brake is barely doing any work as you can see here. There's still a lot of rust and I've probably put about 1500 miles on the car just driving it to and from work. So the first thing we're going to do, I'm going to hit all my uh, bolts with penetrating oil and we'll get started from there. All right, so we're on the passenger side front corner. The first thing I'm going to do is start by cracking loose the bolt holding the rotor to the hub. And this is a six millimeter Allen. Okay, pretty easy. So we run into our first hiccup over here. The line going to the caliper seems to be seized on. It's starting to strip, so we're gonna have to replace this brake line which it's not a big deal we just disconnect it from right there I've already cracked it loose 
you would just spin that bottom portion of the nut it's a 17 millimeter spanner and hold the top with an 11 millimeter spanner and then she starts twisting out as you can see brake fluid is already starting to leak from there so good old advanced auto I placed the order it should be here uh, probably within the next 20-30 minutes so we'll have these uh, brake hoses replaced as well So now with our brake line disconnected, we've got we've got two 16 millimeter bolts that hold the uh, the brake to the spin belt. So we're gonna get those cracked.
all right so we are all done for the front rotors on calipers on new brake lines are on and tightened same thing for this side we're all good now we can move on to the rear Hopefully this goes a little bit smoother than the front.
all set. Rears are done, fronts are done. She should definitely be stopping a lot better now. So, last step right now, we've got the brake fluid. Uh, we've got a power bleeder, we're gonna try that out. Uh, so, we'll, uh, we'll set up the camera again, time lapse it. Maybe walk you through it, I don't know, we'll see. But all that's left is the bleeding brakes. Alright guys, that's going to wrap up today's video. Just got out of the shop. It's about 5.40 right now. So, did good time considering we had to order a couple extra parts. But all, all of the brake system is completely redone. So we've got new rotors, new pads, new calipers all around the car. We were able to reset the brake service intervals for the front and rear. Uh, we've got new brake sensors and car is absolutely driving amazing right now so one more thanks to advanced auto i can't thank you guys enough uh, you guys made this video possible um, and i'm going to continue to use you guys for my regular parts orders on the cars that i service at the shop so um, i think the next video um, is going to be the front and rear suspension overhaul that we're going to be doing. Um, still waiting on parts for that. Uh, we were able to secure another sponsor, um, but this is going to be more for uh, upgraded uh, parts. So we got some full bolt on parts coming, um, and I'll let you guys know in the next video uh, who provided those parts. But it's going to be uh, car, car has definitely come a long way since we bought it. Um, she's driving beautifully. Um, here you can I'll use some uh, some driving right now I'm I'm basically uh, hands off the wheel this car is driving pretty straight right now and uh, let's see if I don't want to brake check anybody here on the highway but before when I would hit the brakes this thing would the wheel would jerk to one side so we'll see what it does now I got hands off the wheel hit the brake oh beautiful look at that I'm extremely happy with the way this came out so we'll leave it at that guys have a happy new year hopefully next year brings you guys uh, wealth and prosperity and uh, and many more good things to come uh, especially from this channel so We'll see you on the next video.